New at 5.30, the Food and Drug Administration has approved the first direct generic competitor to the EpiPen, setting the stage for a cheaper competition that may lower the prices. Fox 24's Lance Lloyd in studio with what this means for people who depend on that very device. Lance. Yeah, Hillary, you've probably heard about the EpiPen. I Many can't leave the house without it, and a pair of these can run, run you up to $600. But experts say with more competition soon to be on the market, those prices could change. Really know what's going to happen. The fear for many people who live with severe allergies, causing them to carry an injectable epinephrine device. Those like Rochelle Nichols know firsthand the impact it can have on your life. Just out of the blue, I started getting hives, and then it's progressively gotten worse. And especially since the doctors can't figure out what I'm allergic to that's causing this, then it's, it's kind of living on edge every day. But for Nichols, even after the help of insurance and an EpiPen coupon, paying for the device was the biggest hurdle. I still had to pay $310 myself. And as a single mom, I don't, I don't make very much, so I, I just I paid for it, but I was in shock. A shock that pharmacists like James Garland has to witness on a daily basis. It's extremely hard for people to access that because most families don't have an extra three or $400 per month or every six months or once a year laying around for EpiPen. And with the emergence of companies like Teva getting FDA approval to make a similar device, medical professionals say more competition could ease patients' pocketbooks. That is normally the case when you see generics come to the marketplace that replace brand name drugs. A norm that many like Nichols hope they will see sooner rather than later. To know that you're going to have that expense every single year the lower you can get it, the better. While experts believe this additional product will help drive costs down, Teva, Teva Pharmaceutical has not said how much it would charge for the generic product or when it will be available. Live in studio, Lance Lloyd, Fox 24 News. Thanks, Lance. Happy to see the possibility of those prices going down.